Hi, I'm a fraud educator and my friends just love to send me their sketchy texts, so let's take a look at one of them. This one says, due to an invalid address, you have a package that needs to be delivered, but it has been suspended due to an incorrect delivery address. If you do not update your address before 24 hours, your package will be returned to sender. To deliver your package, 10 out of 10 grammar, please update your address by click the link below. You got a link, kind of regards. Oh, thank you. USPS team. There are a few red flags that I could point out. And the first one I want to mention is that the scammer or USPS here is using a sense of urgency and some big emotions such as fear or some sort of threat that they're going to, you know, send my package back to get me to act quickly without thinking. So I could potentially see this go, oh my gosh, I do have a package on the way, click the link. And then what might happen is that I might get some sort of virus on my phone, or they might have a web page that asks me to put in more personal information. And if I've already bought in at this point, I might give out certain things that could be used to steal my identity. Another big red flag here is if you take a look at the sender up there, uh, it's from at qb3gl.com, probably not the USPS. The link here is eb4.us, also probably not the USPS. So, you know, big old red flags there. My recommendation is if you get a text like this, block the sender, delete the message, and then if you do actually have a package coming from the USPS, just give them a call or stop at your local post office. Did I miss any red flags here? Let me know in the comments.